Would you look at this? I am trapped in a bedrock room <laughs> with uh, <laughs> redstone torches. What? You're probably asking, Sibikabula, so what could you be finding? Oh, could I be finding Demetu Cosita? What about Entity 303, huh? What about that guy? What about just fighting the wither? Or <laughs> Redstone Steve? <laughs> Green Steve? Toilet Steve? What could I possibly be doing in a room, a bedrock room, full of just redstone torches that's dark, scary, and looks really creepy, and it has me in it with two eyeballs? Well, if you think I'm doing something scary, I'm not. I'm just playing a fan map that's created by a fan. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Uh, this is a fan-created map. Um, you can tell by all the unspeakable ads. Let's read these signs. Do not cheat. Have fun. Be in adventure mode. This map contains five levels. And the last is a boss fight. This is me. Hello. Specially made for Unspeakable, aka Nathan, and this is by WarZZMC. So, dude, thank you so much for making me this map. This is awesome. Oh, I didn't even see this. What the heck? Is this how the map starts? Well, all right. <laughs> you didn't complete the map, though. There's a missing torch. Let me fix that for you. Oh, wait. This would be cheating. Oh, well. I'll cheat anyways. <laughs> and there you go. <laughs> what if I place that torch down like the whole map blew up? It was like connected to like some redstone circuit. That would honestly be hilarious. All right. We'll hop down here. Wait, wait, wait. We have an extra redstone torch. Where, where can we put it? Can I put it on your head? Okay. I'll put it right there. Right there. Oh, wait. I'm in adventure mode. I can't place anything. Anyways, let's get started on this map. This is a map entirely made just for me. So thank you so much to the creator for making this. I have no idea what to expect either. Okay, looks like we got some lava. Parkour. There's a chest over there. Okay, I'll go grab this little chest. What is this? A lever that can be placed on a block of diamond. Well, that wasn't too hard. You see, sometimes... These maps can be kind of easy, but sometimes they can also be very tricky. Okay, it's your time to choose the right path. Never underestimate any of the path you select. Follow the torches. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm following the torches. I'm not following the torches. I'm not, okay, kind of. Left or right? Ah, you can't get back after choosing the path. Off! Oh! Flip! This is the hardest decision I've ever had in my- Wait, you can't get back? Does that mean, like, if I choose one path, like, the map is different? Ah! Okay, um... Flip! I don't know. Dude, left or right? Okay, they're both command blocks. Okay, so we can't look and see if there's, like, lava down there. Okay, okay. All right, what do I choose? What do I choose? What do I flip and choose? Uh, oh! I accidentally choose left. Okay, I guess we're going left. Okay, I guess that's not the right path. You can't get back after choosing the path. I'm back. <laughs> All right, I guess we're going right. What is this? And this is called dropper. Ah, a dropper full of lava. Okay, I've played one of these before. You basically have to pick the right square. It looks like at the bottom, there's four little lava squares and one of those lava squares, or maybe two, or maybe all of them. And excuse me, did I ask for you to toggle your downfall? I was trying to talk. Thank you, Rain. Go away. But one of those squares or some of those squares should have water. Nope, not that one. What about this one? Oh, flip. <laughs> I can't believe that didn't even kill me. I really thought that was gonna kill me. Jeez, that was a far drop. Okay, maybe this one? Oh, flip. Oh, flip. Oh, look at- Oh, what? That was not what I was expecting. Okay. At least we found the right one, though. Oh, oh, come on. <laughs> Honestly, he should have made it where there's just, like, one water block. That would be savage. That would be savage. Oh, I'm so close. This is a pretty cool dropper. Like, honestly, I like this map. I really, I'm enjoying it, even though I'm dying like a hundred times. <laughs> Fight! <laughs> what? Are you serious? How hard is it to land in this? Like, am I really this bad right now? Come on, Unspeakable, you're really not this bad. I, re I really hope you're not this bad. Oh my gosh. Now's my time to shine. I just smack it every time. What if I do a 360 and pull something cool? Off? Okay, I did th another 360. Another. Oh, flip. Oh, 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 hopefully it's this one. Oh, it's not this one. It was the, it was that one. 360, yeah. Oh my gosh, am I really this bad? I think I know the trick to it. I need to land, like, on the, I'm gonna go, like, against the wall. That's what I'm gonna do. There we flip and go. It's about time. Now we gotta find a chest that's probably somewhere in here. Uh, 
there's not a chest in here. There's not a chest in here. I don't. I don't have it. I don't have it. I don't have. I don't have your. But I don't have it. What? What does the sign say? You did it, though. The dropper. Congrats. Okay. Well. Um. I actually didn't do anything. Oh! 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 I see it. I see it. Flippin' sneaky little chest. Oh! 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 oh thank you. You did it. Throw the dropper. Congrats. Now, find the stone button and get out of the maze. Well, that was pretty easy to get out of the maze, but I guess I'll find the stone button. Um, ah, you think you sneaky? You think you sneaky? Oh, I didn't even see. What? Did I wait? Wait, are you? I, I promise I've never played this map before. I literally went all the way to the end and I was just like, oh, there it is. But literally the whole entire level is full of those little like crevices oh my gosh i literally skipped everything okay now this is the maze okay all right hold on one sec hold on so we're not supposed to put this button anywhere no okay all right we got this this maze shouldn't be too difficult um mm -hmm, mm -hmm. i'm usually pretty good at mazes i'm not gonna say i'm the best but i'm pretty decent and look at that look at that look at that let's place that right there do not cheat because you can skip this part okay is this the boss fight i already made it to the boss fight not flipping bad not bad okay get ready to fight the boss oh i'm ready i was born ready oh is this, are these barrier blocks oh these are barrier blocks okay uh all right i don't know if i'm ready for this what is this over here okay i guess i'm ready to fight the boss in this invisible container what what? What? Wait, I'm on- Oh, I'm on peaceful mode. <laughs> Rookie mistake. All right, let's do this again. Uh, oh, it's just a wither. Easy. Easy. He'll be dead in a couple seconds. Not a problem. Especially- Wait, didn't I have protection for armor? Like, come on. I got protection for armor, and the wither is trapped in this room with me? Oh, buddy, you're gonna have the time of your life. Just let me get some nice- Sword hits on- Okay, ne never mind. No sword hits for you. Just stay still. Just stay still. This will only be painless. The more you shoot at me, the more I'm going to get angry, and the more you're going to suffer. Stop, 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 stop. You only have three heads. How are you shooting so many times? Okay. All right. You know what? I'm going to take a break from this guy. I'm going to take a quick little break. Slimes, how you doing? You guys having a good day? Okay. All right. Wither doesn't take breaks. Come on. You nub. I'm just trying to fully charge all my bow shots. I can't even hit. I feel like I can hit him with my, my, my sword, but I can't. He's so far away. Oh, now you're charged. Oh, now he's angry. Now he's angry. Oh, I'm almost dead. Oh, flip. What is this? Can I go in here for protection? Oh, I can. Oh, what? It's like a little safety hideout. That's kind of cool. I can just chill here. <laughs> Take an L for me, buddy. Take an L. Look at that. Look at that. Hold on. Hold on. While you're sitting there, I'm going to get more eyeballs for my microphone. Just so my microphone can see that I'm about to wreck your face. Okay, now I'm ready. Ah! 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 Oh, flip. Okay, I'm going back in the safety hideout. <laughs> this is so OP. I can just chill in the safety little hideout. All right. Well, we got the nether star. Also got an arrow stuck in the wall, but that's okay. Um, is this the end of the map? If I'm pick, if, if, I can't even say my own name. If Unspeakable plays this map, give me a shout out. Thank you so much for playing. Leave a link to my channel if you can. Hope this comes in a video. Well, buddy, this is your, this is your beautiful head. And this is my beautiful head, okay? So this was a beautiful map, but I have one more thing for you guys before we end this. Now we're in another bedrock room. Um, what are we gonna be finding today? Green thief? No, no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. This is a this is a totally different map. This is not the same map. Um, but this is made by Yawning Bear 16, especially for Unspeakable. I'm not gonna tell you guys what it is. I'm just gonna show you. Okay. TP. Okay. Let let me TP to two eight four four two six one six. What could it possibly be? Oh, let me guess. A dabbing Unspeakable. <gasps> <laughs> what? Literally, this whole entire map is just a dabbing unspeakable. I don't think there's anything inside. If I fly inside here, no, there's like nothing inside. It's on. Wait, is this thing full of wool? Oh my gosh, that is dedication. This guy filled the whole thing full of wool. The inside isn't even hollow. Oh my gosh, that's some. Is, is, are the are the hands full of wool? That's some dedication right there. 
That is some dedication right there. So we got a dabbing unspeakable to end off this video. Guys, I know this video was a little bit shorter than most uh, just because the map was kind of short. But if you want me to do more... Oh, flip, press the wrong button. If you want me to do more fan maps on this channel, all you need to do is leave a like on this video and all the fan maps that get submitted to me, I review a ton of them and hopefully get the best or most entertaining ones into videos for you guys. Now, before we end this video, I want to do something special. I want to blow up this dabbing unspeakable. And you're probably like, unspeakable, why would you do that? And my question or my answer to that is why not? Actually, you know what? We should make a house out of his brain. We should make a house out of his brain. Should we, should we do that? We should make a house out of his brain. What? Let's, let's not end the video here. Let's make it longer, guys. Come on, let's make it longer. Let's let's make a house. Okay, you know what? We're gonna make a house. We're gonna make a house. You know, I really thought about ending the video right over there, but for those of you still watching, there's there's the, the video is still going on. It's still going on. You see, it's it's still recording. Everything's still it's still rolling. But for those of the people that clicked off the video, <laughs> well, you just missed out on the best part. We're gonna dig down into this dude's head, and we're gonna hollow out uh, a room, literally. Okay, so we'll start the flooring like right here. Oh my gosh, this is this is gonna be so difficult. I'm assuming this guy used world edit for this, but honestly, who knows? Honestly, who knows? He could have done this all by hand, which honestly, I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> we are almost done hollowing out this room of the dabbing unspeakable head. I don't know what the flip we're going to do, with this room, but we'll do something cool with it. We'll, we'll make like the unspeakable headquarters out of it or something. I don't flippin' know. It would be great and we will celebrate in here. Okay, okay. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take green lime stained glass. I'm gonna make some windows out of this dude. So uh, kind of looks like I have like a little nose or something that looks weird, but we'll make some windows out of the walls and stuff. Here we go. So this is the unspeakable headquarters, ladies and gentlemen. Prepare to be unspeakably blown away. <laughs> All right, check this out. Look at this, look at this. I got walls, or not walls, glass all around the edge. So this is my unspeakable little headquarters. I'm gonna dig in here. Uh, excuse me, sir. Uh, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Oh my gosh. All right, so what should I do now? I just need a lot of things that are green. Okay, let's just pick everything that's green in Minecraft and we're all gonna put it in this room. Emeralds, emerald ore, lime concrete, lime concrete powder. Uh, that's not green enough. Uh, carpet, slime blocks, okay. Uh, lime shulker box, lime bed. Mm, ah, that's got a little bit of yellow in it. Creeper heads, why not? Lime banner, why not? Nothing green in the redstone category, unfortunately. Any green potions? There is some green potions. We'll get to those in a second. Any green, ah, oh, green arrows. Ha ha ha, look at that. Any green foods? No, 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 no. All right, so I think I got everything that's green in Minecraft to represent the green theme and the green unspeakable and the, the green and the whatever. So let's, uh, let's figure out where we're gonna put our bed. So we will put a bed right here, which will be surrounded by beautiful slime blocks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot one thing. We need a uh, cacti. Cacti are green. Okay, those are green enough. Those fit. There we go. There we go. Okay. Now we need uh, just carpet. Why not? YOLO. Over here, over here, we will make kind of a kitchen, um, which unfortunately can't have. Actually, okay, fine. We can have a furnace. Okay, furnace might not be green, but we'll put it in there. Excuse me, phone. I am in the busy of recording. So we'll do two furnaces, we'll do a crafting table, we'll do a double chest, we'll do another chest, well, no, no, we'll do another, well, yeah, there we go. And then what else do we need? We got some banners, we'll put, uh, where the flip am I gonna put some banner? Oh, wait, here, we'll do shades over the windows. Yeah! Now we flipping talking, boys! Look at that, some privacy for the bedroom. Oh my gosh! <laughs> you can make a lot of great things with green, you know? You don't need everything. Uh, to be a certain color in Minecraft, you just need a bunch of green. And then we will put our most prized possessions on this wall. So we'll do an arrow. We will do a uh, emerald, a creeper head. Um, and we got some lime concrete as well. I guess we will kind of cover the kitchen and some of that and kind of a design that's kind of a darker green shade, if that makes sense. And then we also have some lime concrete powder. We'll do another layer of that. Why the flip not? 
There we go! Awesome! All right, so I think that is gonna kind of suit the little unspeakable room. We pretty much used all these blocks. A couple more that we could use, but you know, just some simple stuff. We do another flower pot over here with a little bit of a cacti right there. And I think that's about it. We do have emerald ore as well. We'll do, um, we'll do this. We need more trophies, but here, we'll do this and this. And then we will do just two more emeralds. That's my, that was my most prized possession. So this is the unspeakable room. Let me give you guys a quick little tour. This is my bed surrounded by slime, uh, green uh, carpet with green ground, with green banners, with green glass, with green beds. And then I have my wall of achievements. Everything is green. And then I have my kitchen. Unfortunately, the appliances are stainless steel. <laughs> Couldn't get green ones, ridiculous. But it's still a beautiful kitchen. A layered with some beautiful lime concrete powder and some lime concrete for the flooring around the kitchen. Just in case I drop some of my green slime that I'm making for breakfast it won't stick to the floor. But guys, that is pretty much gonna wrap it up for this video. I was gonna blow up this structure, but now that I put such a beautiful house in it, I really don't want to. But maybe we'll come back to this world and we'll transform the rest of my mouth into a really cool house. If you guys want to see me do that, just leave a like on this video. I'll make a whole video where I literally kind of hollow out the mouth and make it like a bunch of different rooms. Like I'll make it like some chess rooms, a bunch of different stuff. And then I'll put the world up for download, of course. Um, and you guys can maybe download it and stuff. I'll still give all the original credit to the creator and all that stuff. Um, but I want to thank both the creators for making both of these maps. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Seriously, thank you guys so much. Have a safe and fantastic rest of your day. My name's Unspeakable. Stay safe, stay awesome, and stay unspeakable. And I will be seeing you guys tomorrow in a brand new Minecraft video. <laughs> Tomorrow's video is pretty insane. You do not want to miss it. I promise.